Hello everyone, D. Fish here with Rockstar Consulting, bringing you another edition of the Rockstar Success Library. We've got a great topic today. I want to talk about four ways that you can handle the overwhelming amount of information that's available online to things like social media sites, websites, blogs, online newspapers, and the like. Uh, there's four real simple things you can do to really minimize the effect of the overwhelm of information. The first is simply to realize that you know there's not all of the answers out there on uh, social media sites and, and websites and blogs. Understand that you're not going to miss anything if you don't make yourself available to all of that information. And so take some of the pressure off of yourself. The second is to understand that because there is so much information that there is a lot of noise. A lot of it is not that relevant or is not that good. There's a lot of differentiation in the quality of information that's out there. So again, be very uh, careful about where you spend your time, but also feel okay with just not paying attention to certain sources of information that aren't, aren't as valuable or as relevant to what you're trying to do with your business and your life. The third thing that you can do is just understand that you want to limit the number of places that you hang out online. Uh, because there are so many different blogs out there and, and online social media sites, you could easily spend 5, 10, 12 hours a day just online looking at all these different uh, sources. I really recommend that you just pick one or two different places that you're going to spend a majority of your time. Uh, for example, I spend some time on LinkedIn every day, uh, a little time on Facebook and Twitter, but that's really it. I don't really do a lot of blog surfing or anything like that. And where you're going to spend your time really depends on what you're trying to get as far as the information that you're looking for. But again, limit the number of places you hang out so you don't have to spend the hours and hours in front of your computer. And finally, the fourth idea is simply read more books. Uh, the reason why I say that is because the, the information cycle online is so fast, it's so easy to get the information out there, that although you might get some timely information, there's not really a lot of time to test out the information. The great thing about books is because that cycle is much longer, it's much uh, easier to make sure that you have relevant information, uh, useful information, and high quality information. So I do suggest that you uh, read a few more books during, during your, uh, your week and maybe a little, uh, spend a little less time on the blogs. Those are four ideas that I have for you about how you can handle the overwhelming amount of information online. I'll see you next time at the Rockstar Success Library.